National Park College Nighthawk Baseball is on the Nighthawk Network, your official home for Nighthawk Athletics this season. Our Washita Children, Youth, and Family Services featured Nighthawk of the Week, Mr. Hunter Quill. Hunter, welcome back to National Park College, year number two for NPC. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, well, I come from Northwest Arkansas, Bentonville to be specific. Uh, I play outfield for our baseball team. And that's about it. You're here for year number two in Nighthawk Nation. How did you get here? Kind of take us back in time to year number one. How did Coach Rich Thompson find you? Well, I was playing in the summer, and uh, it was actually our assistant coach, Mark, Mark Wyatt. He came in with my games and just loved the way I played, uh, got in contact with me, and decided to give me an offer. And the rest is history, all the way from Bentonville down to Hot Springs. Now you're back for year number two, and, and last year you were a consistent force at the plate for this team. You're very good at getting on base. Your defense in the outfield is incredible. And now back for year number two, you're a sophomore leader for this squad. But why was it important for you to make sure that you were back in Nighthawk Blue for year number two? I just love the people here. I love the coaches. So I want to come back, give it one more shot uh, with the newcomers, with everybody else that I had made a connection with. Already off to a great start at the plate this season, batting 333 and coming off of a tough road trip. I know LSU Eunice is the real deal. They're number two in the nation for a reason, but it's also a great learning experience. Of course, you know this all too well from last year going and playing against the Bengals as well. And now as a sophomore leader, how, how what are some of the ways that you've stepped up this year to kind of help you know, uh, alleviate some of the, the worry that comes from dropping a three-game series and, and getting your team in the right position to get back in the win column? Uh, you know, just helping everybody stay focused. Uh, I think that's the biggest thing. Losing three games like that, it's, it takes a toll on you. But if you just stay focused, know who you are, uh, know who you are as a team, stay together, then it's, it's not that hard to bounce back. I like that. Know who you are. And this team features a lot of new faces this year. Has a solid returning group from last year. But together, meshing together, what does this National Park College team look like? As we prepare for our home opener, what can fans expect to see out of this year's group? Uh, they can expect an exciting group of young men. Uh, I think when we're all doing well, we're all on the same page. Uh, I think we're a very good baseball team. So. so we mentioned at the home opener Friday against Dallas College Richland, another team that's hitting the baseball really well right now. They're ranked number one in Division Three in home runs. And what is the game plan coming back in? No place like home at Majestic Park here in Hot Springs. What are you guys working on specifically in order to shut them down and get your first home wins of the season? Uh, so I think our pitchers, they, they just need to hit their spots, uh, do their job. And then a uh, big thing is our hitters need to step up uh, in big time situations. Uh, that was something that hurt us at Eunice. So if we can figure out how to clutch up in those moments, then I think we'll be okay. And of course, the season is just getting underway. We're really at the starting line still. And as we look ahead to the year and all the possibilities that lie ahead, what are some of the goals that you've set for yourself this year, as well as Coach Rich Thompson and Mark Wyatt on where this team will go in 2024. Uh, so some of the goals I've set for myself, uh, I want to go somewhere next year. Uh, I want to make it to a four-year college, uh, and I just I want to play with no regrets. Uh, I want to I want to know that I left everything out there on the field. And uh, for our team, I think we want to make it back to or we want to make it to Enid uh, last year. Uh, didn't end on good note, obviously. We didn't make it to Enid. Uh, so I think that's one of the main goals this year. Well, you know what they say, adversity brings out the best in people. This is a team that is battle-tested and hungry for success in 2024. We can't wait to see what the team does this season. Congratulations on the honor this week, Hunter. Is there anybody that you'd like to say hello to who may be watching? Uh, I'd like to say hello to my mom, family back home. Uh, I'm doing good. So. He is doing good. Hunter Gwill of Nighthawk Baseball. You can follow the team online on Facebook, Instagram, and X. Special thank you to Washita Children, Youth, and Family Services, the sponsor for the featured Nighthawk of the Week. He's Hunter Gwill. I'm Mark Oliver, and this is Nighthawk Baseball on the Nighthawk Network.